My little Lola is joining me today. I hope that my husband is not going to watch this video. He he said he watched my videos, but I think he's just trying to be nice. I don't really think he watched my videos. Hi guys, I'm Heather. Welcome to String and Parcel. So I'm gonna make this very quick because I have the tendency to like just, I talk and I just talk and I just talk and so Anyway, I'm gonna cut right to the chase. Okay, so a few days ago, my husband was telling me that he said, hey, you know, babe, I really, I'm happy that you found a hobbies and that you have a channel and that you enjoy doing your, you know, your YouTube videos, uh, but try not to spend so much money because, you know, you do have the tendency to like buy a lot of things and not necessarily things that I, I that I uh, wear I just buy it just because I'm there and it's convenience so I told him I said yeah no problem I won't be buying anything so you know like I say I'll cut it down and usually I like to I thrift things and then I save them over the course of like two to three weeks and then I do a thrift haul so anyway long story short a few days ago I went to the post office and then on my way home there's a Goodwill and I swear to God it is two minutes away and if you are a thrifter you know that if you pass by any kind of thrift store it almost feels wrong not to go in and like take a quick look right I mean I don't know about you guys but at that time I feel like I was literally passing through it and I feel like oh my god I'm here I have to go in and I have to look so again long story short I didn't bring my phone didn't bring my wallet I just took my credit card didn't bring my purse and I say I'm gonna go in really quick uh, just to take a look and then I'll be right back well in my mind when I was you know trying to go in there for like 10 15 minutes it turned out to be an hour an hour and a half later and you guys want to see the stuff that I got I'm sure you do because I wanted to show it to you all right here we go so not only did I spend some money not only did I okay so not only did I not stay there for 10 or 15 minutes I was there for an hour and a half and look what I got this is bag number one bag number two so we fill this up and um, so it's been a few days I already forgot what I have in here but I got two very full bags and a receipt so oh my god uh, let's focus I don't even know can you see I see how much I spend oh my god so it's not a lot it's like $150 $151 so it's, it's not a lot but that this that it didn't stop here I got more so here is another pile <laughs> okay so I got four pieces from a local thrift store here in Oregon if you are not here near here you heard the if you are not new here you heard the story I pass by this thrift store every Sunday so I swing in and I think I got four and so I was gonna save this you know to collect it to do my next thrift haul so I got four here and then last week I thrifted if I bought something on Poshmark secondhand clothing is that considered thrifted even though it's like on an app to me that's a thrifted item because you know just because I wasn't like physically in a thrift store it doesn't mean that I didn't thrift these items right anyway so I bought a bundle of four and I just don't know what happened to the other two I can't find it but I have two here um, I'll try and find the other two and I already I forgot what I got but I got a bundle of four on Poshmark so I got two here and then I got four from the other store and then two full bags so all right guys so needless to say but we or we i don't have to wait two to three weeks to do another haul because the haul is happening right here right now so i hope that you enjoy this video let's get into it let's do a quick count to see how many stuff i have in this bag because i know i have four six six items that I thrifted from two different places and then I already forgot how many items I have in this bag so I'll do a quick count real quick so one, two, three, four, five, six, six, six in one bag, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right so oh my god can you guys see all this crazy stuff okay so 
I have 13 items from One Goodwill. So right now in front of me, I have about 19 items and I'm missing two. I don't even know what happened to it or where it is or what it is that I order. Um, God, I'm like losing my mind. I'll do three things. I'll show you guys what it is, the brand, if there's a brand, and then how much I pay for them. And then I'll do like a try on right next to it. So I hope you enjoy, let's get into it. I'm gonna so I'm gonna show you the first four items that I got from the small thrift store called Williams Temple here in Portland Oregon so I saw this um, linen short it is really cute um, some of this I was trying to think if I've tried on any of it no I have not I only tried on this short but I haven't tried on any of it um, so this Okay, so, okay, so this is H&M, right? And it was a pretty good price. It was only $5. And this short is, I wish it was 100% linen, but it is not, but it's okay. I'm okay with cotton. So it has like 45%, 55% linen, and then 45% uh, cotton. So that's good enough for me. Um, and I think, it looks a little big. It's a size me US medium, so it is a little big, but I think it has the elastic waistband and then it has the drawstring, so I think it's gonna be okay. Um, and I think I'm gonna be wearing this a lot in the summer. So very basic, you know? I mean, you really can't go wrong with just a basic beige short, especially linen for the summer. Slap on a white t-shirt, or actually, as a matter of fact, this one right here, and we're good. So that's the first one. Oh my God, I forgot that I also have a linen shirt. Uh, this one is $7, okay. All right, so I've never heard of this. It's, what is it called? Island Company, extra small. This one is 100% linen and the price was pretty good. Seven dollars. Oh my God! Yeah, maybe. Look at this, cute little outfits. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be cute. So maybe I'm gonna try this two on together. So there's my first outfit. And then, oh, this next one is. Uh, and usually I don't really find Zazan, um, or is it Zizan or Zazan? Oh, it's a French name. Is it, I, I pronounce it Cezanne. I don't know how you guys pronounce it. I'm pretty sure I, I'm pretty sure I say it wrong. Usually I never really find this at a thrift store. If I, this is the kind of brand, this is the one brand that I actually would like thrift on their website. Um, I know they have a store in San Francisco, which is where I'm from. So if I ever like come back there to visit, I will definitely go into that store. But other than that, um, I do buy this brand on their website. So here is the brand, right? And it's a size 38, which in my mind, I think it is a medium because uh, with Cezanne, I wear a 34 or 36, but this is a 38 and I haven't tried it on. It's not cheap, but it's not crazy expensive either. Okay, so they wanted $25, and so I was will, I was more than willing to pay $25 for this brand because I am a real, I'm a true fan of this brand. It's very, very cute. So polka dot, it's silk, it's line. So, you know, although, I think I've also mentioned that I actually love wearing black in the summer. I know it sounds insane, but like this top right here is gonna be so adorable to like wear to go out for like a summer nighttime dinner. You know, it will be very, very cute with just some white linen pants. I think that would look absolutely adorable. I love this I love this shirt. Look, look at the look at the detail on the neck. It's pretty very very pretty so I'm very excited for this top right here so we got one two three four and then a few years ago I used to love this brand but I'm kind of like falling out of love with this brand but I still pick them up 
Um, I shouldn't have picked this up because it wasn't like the cheapest. Um, I wish it was $9, but I don't know. Uh, three years ago, I'm, a, I'm like completely obsessed with this brand, but right now, these days, I'm like, okay. Um, and I'm sure most of you guys also know about this brand. Okay. So it's the Reformation and it is also silk. They also wanted $25 for it, you guys. This store right here, they mark most of their stuff $25. It's crazy. And they're very picky with their donation. It's like when you want to donate something, you have to wait in line and then this guy will always like go through all of your stuff and then they, they're like very picky. They'll like, they'll check all your stuff and they'll like tell you what they want and what they like reject, which I kind of find weird because it's all donated. But anyway, they're very picky with their stuff. Um, why did I say that this is silk? Like, I don't even know why I say that. It feels like it was, no, it doesn't even feel like silk. I am such a liar. Um, God, even with my glasses on, I can't even see it. It said it is 58, 53% viscose. Again, we are still trying to figure out how to pronounce that, uh, fabric. Is it viscose or viscose? Please tell me, I don't want to sound like a moron because I actually don't know how to pronounce that. Um, and then 47% rayon, rayon I can say, 47% rayon and then 53% V-I-S-C-O-S-E, viscose. I'm going to stick with that. So this is a maxi skirt. Why am I screaming? I don't know why. I'm very close to you and I am talking very loud and I'm screaming but I want to show you guys this too I don't really wear maxi skirts this day I mean obviously when I was way younger like 50 years ago I would wear like maxi skirts but I don't maxi skirts I mean, I would wear like mini skirts, but I don't really wear mini skirts anymore. But I thought that this mustard color, and I would save it for like the fall. Like I would wear this with some black tights and then like with a, a knee high boot for the fall. So we're gonna have to wait. Um, obviously I'll do a try on, but I just cannot wait to wear this in the fall. Look at the bottom, you guys. It's like a scallop hem. And I believe this is a genuine leather, like suede. It is like in amazing condition. Uh, yes, 100% genuine leather. I don't know if it matters if I show it to you guys. Okay. And the brand on this, There you go. See it? Uh, stone I Immaculate. It's a size medium, so I think the waist is a little big. I'm not sure. Nope, I think it fits. We'll see. I always do that. So it's, oh, that's a tiny little marking. I don't know if you guys can see. Tiny little marking. So like, I love suede, but suede can get like, it gets like stained really easy if you're not careful with it. But I just bought it because this color is so pretty. I'm not even like a big color person. I like to say neutral, you know, I wear a lot of like white and beige and gray, but this color is just absolutely beautiful. And so, I'm excited. I forgot what the bundle came out to be. Um, it wasn't cheap, but it was definitely not expensive. But then it was, it's also definitely not, bleh, definitely not a thrift store pricing. Well, those, the top and the skirt was $25. So it might as well be like a, a thrift store pricing. Cause I think it probably came out to be like $20 a piece. 
Oh my God, look at this one. Another brand that I really love and I am like a big fan and has been a fan for a long time is Christy Dawn. Okay. I am a big fan of this brand, Christy Dawn. I'm a big fan of Doen, D-O-E-N. -O -E Those are like my absolute, it's just, you know, they are pricey. And so when I feel like they are pretty good materials. So, you know, you do get what you pay for. So when I feel like having like better quality pieces, I will stick with Cezanne and Christy Dawn and Doen. Those are all my absolute favorite brands. Like, you know, I wish I can buy all of those brands. But this is a very long dress. Uh, it's a size small, but it looks pretty big. And so, she, I bought it from this girl on Poshmark and she says she only wore it like once. It looks actually in an amazing, it looks, it looks great. I inspected it. The condition looks amazing. And she didn't mention that it has pockets, but thanks. Thanks so much. It has pockets. It's long sleeve. It's very, very pretty. I should actually see what kind of... So these are all made uh, made from dead stock up, upcycle recycle fabric. That's all that it said. So I don't exactly know what kind of fabric composition that goes into this dress, but it's all like recycled material. So that's really good. So that's that. Okay, so we got all of that out of the way. And then, so now let's get into um, the 13 items that I got at Goodwill. All right guys, so unfortunately I have some family things that I need to deal with uh, and that I'm dealing with and so I do not have the time to uh, do a the haul for that two bag that I got at Goodwill and a try on but I promise that is coming. So I'm just gonna go ahead and upload this video. I'm sorry, it's a there's not a lot of stuff in here but I think quite, um, six outfits is is good enough, I hope. And so I hope that you enjoyed this video. And if you did, um, please don't forget to hit the like and consider um, subscribing if you haven't already. And as always, I really appreciate all your support. Thank you. Bye for now.